about how, my, how am I gonna forget it? All I can do is watch. <laughs> it's Duke. I ain't gonna help him, man. If I got a stick, I'll help him. Duke stopped. And Tommy's like, eh, eh. He starts sniffing him. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, Tommy gets up to make a break for it. But Tommy's only this big. Duke gets on his hind legs. I'm not lying to you. This is a horrible, horrible sight. I, I'm not even exaggerating. On my child's life, his two front paws grasp on to Tommy's shoulders, knock this poor kid to the ground, and starts dry humping the crap. <laughs> And this is like Tommy running. He likes me hugging me. He likes me. He's hugging me. I don't drink anymore. Well, I do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't drink heavy anymore. I used to plow. Plow. <laughs> I used to drink mind erasers. You ever hear them? Oh. You know, what I was thinking is like vodka, Kahlua, and soda water in a glass like that with a straw, and you have to suck it down as quick as possible. <laughs> Which is fine, but like three minutes, you know, all the carbon monoxide takes your liver as a ah! Ah! to your burp. But you have like two of them, then you find out why they call mind erases. Your mind erases all communication and the rest of your body. I gotta go to the bathroom. But to me, you know, if you drink and you're over 21, you get hammered. It's goofy. You're dead drunk, man. I'm that guy, too, I have to tell you. I'm wasted, man. Are you guys wasted like me? Because I'm wasted. You're not wasted? How can you not be wasted? Because I'm like, okay, let's say this is hammered. Let's say this is like, whoo, look out. <laughs> And let's say this is wasted. I'm like, look out, Hammer, take your shirt off. But to me, the only time when drinking is fun, which it is fun, is when you're a kid. And I mean by that is like 15, 16, because then it's like an Olympic event. <laughs> There's all these little rules and stuff. Starts right away at your mother. Come here. Who are you hanging out with? Now, these friends you're hanging out with, I don't like them. Do you understand me? They don't even introduce themselves. They just drive right up and beat the horn. Ma, they do not. You don't even finish a sentence. Bruna! <laughs> bah, bah! Let's go, Hammer! I'll be back later, Mom. <laughs> you get in the car and your friends are gone. They're peeling out in your neighborhood. <laughs> Chill out, it's a neighbor. Shut up, Barry. <laughs> what are you supposed to be home now? <laughs> and never pass out in front of them. They're just right, you know, uh, they'll write all over you. I crap in my pants. I love crap. I crap my pants. I love eggs and snot. Whatever. They'll dump you right in the front lawn at the end of the night. <laughs> Worst though is my mom, boy, did not want to wake her up. She drank gin martinis before she went to bed. So if you woke up her in the middle of the night, it's like startling a monster. So I'd be like 16, just hammered. And you think, you're so smart. I'm cool. She'll never figure me out. And I can hear her snoring. Uh-oh. 
And I'd always wake her up. I'd always, like, somehow wake her up. This one night I finally got in. I got into my bed. You know that feeling as a kid? Cool. You sit down. But then all of a sudden I saw the door open up behind me. <laughs> Baby Subuki man. She come in the doorway. That was the worst. Thrown on trial. What the hell is going on here, 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 here? Let me ask you something And you better not lie, 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 lie Enough with the... Oh, man Honestly, maybe one. To Hollywood. Hollywood's a little goofy for me. Although, when I was on Saturday Night Live, I enjoyed every second of it. What you got to realize, what I enjoyed about Saturday Night Live is you got to understand, I was living in Long Island, I was paying rent in someone else's house. You know, so when I got that show, it was like, what? There's Tom Hanks. There's Metallica. Jack Nichols and Joe Pesci. I got to meet these guys. I got to work with these guys. Pesci put me on the map. De Niro, they put me on the map. It was the most awesome time of my life. I'll never forget Pesci. The first thing he said to me, he goes, So, um, you gonna thank me for giving you a career? <laughs> I swamp ass, you know. But Jack Nicholson was one of the coolest moments I ever had in my life. Check this out. He comes on to do a guest spot, and I got to work with him, so I called all my friends, I'm like, yo, Jack Nicholson is coming on the show, man! Dude, you gonna work with you? Yeah! Is you gonna, like, hang with him? I don't know, but wouldn't that be awesome? <laughs> so Nicholson came on the show, we worked together, but I didn't get to say hello to him. So I'm a little bummed out, but hey, I, I, I did it with him, and to me, I'll be able to tell my grandkids that. However, later in the night, after Saturday Night Live, there's always a party that the whole cast and crew goes to, and, you know, it's sort of like the end of the week, we go hang out. Well, if you can picture, these are elevator doors, and the show's over, and we're going back to get dressed. You know, take off our clothes, go back to get dressed. Well, behind this barricade are all these people. And I come walking by, and they're all like, hey, they don't really, no, goat man, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> man, okay. Do the go, man, okay. <laughs> so I'm hanging out and I hit the elevator doors. All of a sudden, I swear to you, I hear the crowd start going crazy. Oh my God, the thing is out of control, please. Oh my God, he's out of And before I could turn around, I hear this voice. I swear to you. He goes, hold on to the elevator door. <laughs> It was, dudes, um, it's like a movie. All he sees is the outline of Nicholson. He's got sunglasses on. It's two in the morning. <laughs> like this guy rules. It's two in the morning. He's right in front of me, and he's got a trench coat. And he goes, you got the door? I said, yeah. 
he turns to the crowd and he goes, well, if you got your cameras, start snapping. <laughs> <laughs> so check this out now he gets in the elevator I start flipping I hit six he hits six so it's like me this other cast member Nicholson and this other guy the door shuts I'm not lying to you instant swamp ass I was just like oh my ass is sweating my former <laughs> I'm like hyperventilating and I want to say anything to him. Oh my God, The Shining, when you were just walking down the hallway. And you were... <laughs> One flew over there, put your hand in the air, Chief. Don't you want to watch the game, Chief? Come on, nurse, don't do that to me. Man's a legend. I'm right next to him and I didn't say nothing. I lost the opportunity in life, and just as I thought that, I was like, ah, oh, no. We hit our floor, the doors open. Now, you see the way I look? I forget. <laughs> Nicholson takes a step off the elevator. He stops. He turns to me, he gets right in my face, and he lifts up his sunglasses. You know, you look the way I feel right now. A lot of you are wondering, uh, what's with the band? Set a new baby girl. <laughs> Stick that, you pooper. <laughs> the baked goat is a parent. <laughs> yeah, it was a good delivery. Now I'm my first kid. See, this is the thing. What I learned, so I learned about life in general. If you want to experience life or you want to make a judgment on something, go experience it. Stop watching videos, stop watching TV, and stop reading Parenting Magazine. <laughs> they leave out a lot <laughs> of real life that you're not prepared for. No, this is what to expect. This is, that never, ever is real life. And you never know what's going to happen. You never know. You can't be going out drinking, getting hammered, smoking dope. I'm gonna be your dad. Could be right now. Because you never know when you walk in, boom, it starts. So I walked in, it was late at night. I came in, I hear like a. I look around, I'm like, hon, and she's in the bathroom, hovering over a toilet seat with her panties down. <laughs> oh! oh, God! I feel like I have to crap! <laughs> There's all this pressure on my ass, I gotta crap! What's going on, man? 